Scientists gave them nicotine first, and the ants get brain damage, but not in a way you might expect. See, there's a lot of research on ants and nicotine because it's a natural insecticide. High doses of nicotine hyperactivate the insect nervous system until it shuts down. As ants and humans have similar nicotinic receptors, these studies have been extending into human medicine as well. In this paper, Kamer and colleagues tested ants' ability to associate different colored or scented rooms with food with or without nicotine, while being given water with or without the drug. Researchers found that the ants being fed nicotine moved faster and more erratically while foraging, but moved slower and slept more while they were in the nest. And they also found that the ants being fed nicotine learned how to find new nicotine words very quickly, but stopped making new associations when the drug wasn't involved. On the other hand, ants who weren't regularly drinking nicotine were able to learn to find new food sources with or without the drug. And the researchers think that given the similarities in the nervous system reactions between ants and humans, these tests could serve as a basis for cheaper and faster exploratory research. Fall from Rantlore.